Feeling fresh air is a quality of health. Fresh air not only determines the quality of your health but also determines your mood and the quality of your thoughts. We spend 90% of our lives indoors, so the indoor air quality is very important. I started my indoor plant collection with one of the top air purifiers which is the Indian Tulsi. Planted a few seeds in cups like this for them to germinate and once they were big enough then repotted them into smaller pots and after a few months there you go bushy Tulsi plants but still they have to be repotted because Tulsi grows well when it is one Tulsi in a pot. Particularly when you live in countries where most of the months are winter months, you need to have indoor plants to boost the quality of your air. It is a herbal plant, it has medicinal value and researchers have also shown that Tulsi emits ozone for 4 hours in a day. I will later release a special video of how to maintain Tulsi in winter areas, especially in snowy regions. But for now, this is top of the list. The second one is also a herbal plant. This is called Karpura Valli in Tamil, also called as the Mexican mint. Many of the sellers do not have the exact version of the seeds for this plant. So we have to be very careful when we are procuring the seeds online. This is also one of the important herbal plants that you need to have at home. It comes in handy when somebody has a flu or a cold at home. The decoction or the leaf itself can be consumed with a bit of honey and it gives immediate relief. There comes the next one. She is the queen of beauty, the peace lily. So the peace lily is also one of the top air purifiers at home. It has a capability to reduce or to remove most of the chemical components from the air. Not only that, the flowers are very beautiful and improves or elevates the mood in the house. The next plant which gives abundance of oxygen is the lucky bamboo. These cute ones just lead water and easy to be maintained. The next one on the list is the money plant, the golden pothos. They are an excellent air purifiers and they grow well. We can grow money plant or the golden pothos in soil or just with water. This is just a couple of leaves alone which I planted and they grow well. They have rooted and they've started growing. Another beauty is the Anthurium. This is a perfect indoor plant. She loves shade and only two hours of sunlight in a day. Compared to the previous photo, she has grown well. Since we live in a place which is snowy most of the months, we have a uh, a cart like this which has wheels attached to it so whenever there is sunlight I can roll over the cart like this to my patio for the plants to get enough sunlight and then roll them back during the evening times. This is another wonderful air purifier this is a snake plant uh, I'm just trying to propagate it with just one leaf in water now it has rooted I'll show you how to propagate and um, pot them in a different video. And these are beautiful poinsettias which you get in winter months. These are also wonderful indoor plants and um, the leaves are curled because of a transition shark. We just cut them from the shop and I will also release videos on how to maintain the poinsettias and not to worry about the leaf curls. So this is an yellow one. We also have a few curry plants at home. Uh, these are just smaller ones. When the plants were just growing, it was uh, September, the dormancy season started and so they are just in their rest period. This is just a view of so much snow in the patio and the plants getting some sunlight and this is a view in the spring. So just try out some indoor air purifying plants. These are my plants sitting inside during the winter months. 
Now it's summer so most of the plants from the rack have gone outside to the patio and new seeds have been potted some of them being flowering plants and some of them the herbs for my kitchen and now the golden pothos has taken its place at the top of the shelf adding plants to your home does not only affect the quality of air it also affects the quality of your mood these are some of the vegetable seeds that are coming up so if you are living in a snowy region this spring and summer try to get in seeds for some indoor plants and start growing them so that they get well accommodated to your house so you reap your full benefits in the winter months thanks for watching